Since his contract was terminated by Fox News in 2023, Tucker has been free to do whatever he wants to do. Now, rumors and speculation say that he is trying to interview the leader of Russia, Vladimir Putin. And although Tucker Carlson has been told many times over that he is pro-Kremlin and seems to be a mouthpiece, as pictured here in this political commentary, he has been coined as saying that Americans have been trained to hate Putin and will suffer because of it. So I see how some of these cartoon depictions could come about. Now hear me out, they've also said that Trump is a mouthpiece for Vladimir Putin. Seeing as Russia and Ukraine are still at war, it is curious timing for Tucker Carlson to go there. Considering the man lost his job, he has every right to go anywhere he wants without anybody telling him anything. And now that we have rumors of people saying that he should not be allowed back into his own country of birth. So technically you're saying people going to visit people in Israel or in Palestine should not come back home because they're going to a war-torn country or a country at war? Make this make sense. Thing is, Tucker owes no one any answer for why he's there. It is not uncommon for someone who is in journalism to go to countries and interview anyone that they need to get information from. That includes leaders of countries that may be at war. We've seen this time and time again with news reporters here in the United States interviewing people like Gaddafi and Gorbachev and all the people that we've seen in our past. So this is not abnormal and he should not have anyone telling him he doesn't have a right to return home to his own country.